I don't like that. I'm old enough now to where I there's shows called that '90s show because it was so long ago. <laughs> I'm gonna die soon. Josh! Hey, welcome back to our stupid directions of Corbin. I'm Rick. You can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. Thanks to our Patreon, follow us Twitter account, subscribe, and like button. I'm like 30 years old. Never once paid my taxes. Uh, <laughs> like Donald Trump. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, anyways, today we got a, a video. This is uh, 10 Bollywood actors who refused famous movie roles. Ah, refused them. I guess. Turned them down. I yeah, guess. and that happens all the time. Yes, it you does. know the you know the big one about Avatar, right? It was Brad Pitt, right? No, it was um, Matt Damon. Matt Damon, which Matt Damon turned it down, and and would have been better. Was, he he he. Cameron told him he was going to give him two percent of the box office. I think it was ten percent. Actually, was it ten? I think it was ten. Oh, uh, whatever it was, it, it was it, a lot he of money. Made a lot of money <laughs> <laughs> on top of all the other movies that. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, there's a lot of famous oh, yeah. people who had been offered parts and they didn't take them, and then oh, yeah. someone got it and they turned it into it's be part a of the business role. Yeah, because it, whether it's they didn't want it or a lot of times they couldn't it's do scheduling. it. Yeah, they just couldn't do it. They probably wanted to do it really bad, and it's just they were doing a different film at the time. Or was going on. Or you have a really beautiful story like the original person to play Lincoln, who was signed at the time, was Liam Neeson. And it just kept getting pushed back, schedule conflicts, things of different nature. And the person Spielberg originally approached for it was Daniel Day-Lewis. And at the time, Daniel Day-Lewis felt he was too young to play Lincoln. Uh. Time goes on. Daniel Day-Lewis becomes available. And it's Liam Neeson who says to Steven Spielberg, you might want to revisit that because if you can get Daniel Day-Lewis, you should. Yeah. And he just gave the role up because he felt that it, it should go to Daniel Day Lewis. That's that's an incredible person. Most roles should. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Here we go. See, in any kind of industry, you have to be at the right place at the right time. Yep. And a lot of people account their initial success to that. Be it the young Alia Bhatt auditioning for Student of the Year, or Sushant Singh Rajput and the many years he spent on Indian television. But there are some cases when actors are fortunate to get roles because of some refusal and those roles that they eventually take up become their most iconic and memorable ones. So here is Tried and Refused Productions with top 10 Bollywood actors who turned down famous roles. Kangana Ranawat After her success in movies such as Fashion and Once Upon a Time in Mumbai, Kangana was offered the iconic lead role in The Dirty Picture. Considered to be part breaking huh. cinema and a movie that changed the way women she probably would have done really well. portrayed on screen, the movie later was offered to Vidya Balan and went on Who to did become her most really memorable performance in her career. Kangana, recalling the time she was offered the role in an interview with Rajiv Masan, told everyone why she turned <laughs> down the role. See many similarities about a small town girl wanting to make it big and uh, then falls a prey to that whole glamour and that uh, facade. Right. Um, I just felt I'd be trapped in mm. this whole thing mm. doing mm. the same thing. That makes sense. Yeah. And uh, I was bored of seeing myself. I like her eye makeup. A very attractive person and then uh, crying and sobbing my way to my deathbed. <laughs> <laughs> Akshay Kumar. The actor who at the time was primarily doing action comedies which required little to no effort, movies including Desi Boys, Houseful 2 and Joker, was offered to portray the iconic role of Milka Singh in Bhag Milka. Oh Bhag. wow! The actor turned down the role for unknown reasons and it's surprising to know that even Milka Singh pictured Akshay Kumar to play him in the movie. Farhan Akhtar went on to play the actor on been too the old. screen and definitely put forth an award winning no, performance what year and an it came iconic out. one indeed. Hrithik Roshan Hrithik Roshan, before doing Koi Mil Gaya and Laksh in the early 2000s, was doing a huge set of embarrassing romantic movies like Yaadein, Na Tum Jano Na Hum, and Aap Mujhe Achhe Lagne Lage. The actor in this period was offered Swades and turned down the role. Shah Rukh went on to take the role of Mohan Bhargav, which to date is one of his most underrated performances. He probably would have done well. He would have done well as well. Acclaim, Shah Rukh Khan did really well. Business in the box office. Salman Khan. The 2007 sports film which focused on oh. women's hockey team was a fresh change in Indian cinema. 
proving that scripts and stories focusing on relevant topics can also become a box office success. Shah Rukh Khan, who played the memorable role of Kabir Khan, put forth an amazing performance. But little known trivia is that Salman Khan was actually offered the role first, which he of course turned down. In a DNA interview, Salman jokingly said, "Chakti was offered to me, but I left it because even Shah Rukh Khan should be a part of a few great films." <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. That's great. With the the climax of the film, and um, Adi in fact told me that you know that uh, I will make this into like the biggest hit, and you don't know what you're missing out on. But uh, I didn't think, uh, you know, because I was I was fortunate that partner did well as well, and. Uh, Uh, people have loved the film. That was wrong. Hrithik Roshan and Abhishek Bachchan. The 2001 super hit Dil Chahta Hai is in my opinion Farhan Akhtar's finest directorial work and it's extremely interesting to know the initial casting process for the movie. Farhan Akhtar has been a film family kid and grew up with Hrithik Roshan and Abhishek Bachchan. and he wanted to cast his childhood friends in his first movie the entire fiasco of setting a final cast is vividly recalled by farhan akhtar in a tv interview with and pictures to mere pehle choices actually the uh, akshay khanna uh, rithik aur abhishek they were my first three choices huh. the only person who i got to do the film was was akshay sharukh khan Shah Rukh Khan in the late 90s and early 2000s was doing movies such as K3G, Dev Das and Sathya and had definitely reached the A-list celebrity status. During this time Shah Rukh Khan was offered Rajkumar Hirani's directorial oh, wow. debut Munna Bhai MBBS. The actor refused the iconic role, rumored to be due to his back problems and had multiple meetings with Rajkumar Hirani. The movie oh, he's working with him now. to become a career changing role Donkey. for Sanjay Dutt. Rajkumar Hirani even before approaching producers and SRK had Anil Kapoor in mind for the mm. role but Sanjay Dutt took the role as Munna which ultimately gave him an image makeover and helped change the public perception of the controversial superstar This entire ordeal is discussed in an interview with Anupama Chopra by the director If from the way to Shahrukh when it came to Shahrukh uh, I just couldn't uh, uh, believe that That's a possibility. Ah, that's a possibility. I thought that either Charuk or I believe do. Finally, of course, long journey. And But your end credits say thank you to Charuk. Charuk for we yes. had we had many meetings and uh, uh, yeah, yeah, a lot of fun we had. But it was this time Sanju was this time to be in the film and uh, Saif Ali Khan. Everyone remembers Saif Ali Khan for his roles in Omkara and Salam Namaste. But in 1995, Saif wasn't an established star. doing movies like imtehan and mai khiladi tu anadi <laughs> nice. did you know that when aditya chopra was casting for his directorial debut in 1995 saif ali khan could have been cast as raj in ddlj aditya approached shahrukh khan to play the role of raj he was initially not interested because of the romantic nature of the role having had success in action movies like bazigar and dar aditya then asked saif ali khan to play the lead role Because oh he was wow! Problems persuading Shah Rukh Khan to do it. That would have been different. Declined for unknown reasons. Wow! Causing Aditya to continue pursuing Shah Rukh Khan. Aditya and good thing he did. Aditya presumably <laughs> had four meetings over several weeks. Wow! Persuaded Shah Rukh. Can you That's imagine Saif doing this? That's the biggest bombshell right there. कोई बात नहीं सेनेरी था कोई बात नहीं. बड़े-बड़े देशों में ऐसी छोटी-छोटी बातें होती हैं. That is wow, astonishing. Karina Kapoor. The actress can be considered to be a career maker in the film industry as she has refused several roles that have gone on to become actresses most iconic and best performances. The 3 Idiot star after production and creative issues walked out of Kahona Pyar Hai. Later she said no to Hum Dil De Chuke Sanam which spearheaded Ashwarya's career in the industry. The actress also went on to say no to Kal Hona Ho because of a friendship fallout between her and Karan Johar discussed in the first season of Coffee with Karan. The movie went on to become one of the biggest hits and one of Preeti Zinta's best performances. Even further, Karina had initially said yes to the 2013 smash hit Ram Leela to star opposite Ranbir Singh, but after creative differences and major payment and schedule problems, walked out of the film, leading to quite the war of words. He becomes stood by at times the very set to ban gaye the aur Karina had walked out of the film. जो होता है कभी कभी अच्छे के लिए होता है 
It wouldn't have been Ranveer. The actress could have had a plethora of smash hits if you think about it. Shah Rukh Khan. Shah Rukh Khan makes it again on our list. The Oscar-nominated movie Lagan, which literally got all <laughs> forms of acclaim, is definitely one of the best Bollywood movies wow. made in the 21st Some century. Some of these are mind-boggling. That would have made it very different. Lagan went on to do wonders for Indian cinema on an international level. Little known fact is that Ashutosh Govarikar actually approached Shah Rukh Khan for the role first. In an interview with Vidif, Ashutosh talked about casting SRK. See, Bhuvan's definitions change, as does the script. It's like a paradigm shift. Every actor imparts his personality to a character. The moment he does something, the character undergoes a bit of change. Yeah. And when he does it, everything around him changes. So obviously, Shah Rukh would have played it differently. Absolutely. Very Before different, we discuss yeah. the number one position, here are some honorable mentions. Oh. Interesting. Wow, I actually started shooting. Hmm. problem life potential you could be Shahrukh Khan. You could be Shahrukh Khan. The problem is you think you already are. Oh, wow. Oh, my goodness. Sanjeev, the movie that changed the trend from romantic films to action films and pioneered Amitabh's new image of the angry young man, Sanjeev was an iconic movie that started a new wave in Hindi cinema. This film also ended the struggling period of Amitabh and turned him into a rising star. A movie that did so much for the actor was surprisingly offered to several actors before him. The role of the lead inspector Vijay Khanna was first offered to Dharmendra, who agreed but his brother Ajit, who was co-producing the film, fell out with Prakash Mehra and the actor backed off. <clears throat> Dilip Kumar was offered the movie after that but he thought the role was too one-dimensional. Devanand was next in line but the creators after discussions concluded he was a misfit for the role. Raj Kumar came on later, who had already reprised the role of a cop in Unche Log, rejected the film, and finally the struggling actor Amitabh Bachchan, hmm. after a lot of debate Struck and creative me. meetings, got the film. And everything changed post the movie. Yeah. For a lot of B. people say that's one of the big B ones we need to like get to. Bar, yeah, Shuri, I think we have it. I think Amal that somebody said it. Amitabh Bachchan, in an interview with Rajiv Masand, recalls the reason why he got the role in Zanjeer. Prakash Ji had. Uh, come to me after this film had been recommended to several other uh, senior artists. For some reason, Javed Saab had noticed an action sequence of mine in a film called Bombay to Goa, mm. where I was chewing gum and in the middle of an action sequence, I got hit in the face. I rolled over, stood up again, and apparently I was still chewing gum. <laughs> and he felt that after I saw that moment, I decided that you would be able to do this show. And that was the list, guys. <laughs> Write it down. In wow, the comments that was below. good. There was some wow, that we there's some on. big bombshells in there that blew my mind. And obviously, I'm sure if you look at Hollywood wise as well, there's massive roles. Oh, I mean, yeah. um, Johnny Depp was almost fired from Pirates multiple times because they didn't understand what he was doing. Yeah, the first few days of, I was telling that to Indrani the other day when we went to, to Disneyland for the first time and she mm -hmm. went into Pirates. I told her that Johnny has shown up and yeah. surprised people. And just the choices that were made when the, the dailies, the producers saw the dailies for the first few days, their response was, what the hell is he doing? He's gonna ruin this movie. We've gotta find somebody else to play Captain Jack. Yeah, and there's probably <laughs> 10,000 stories like yeah. that about 10,000 different actors. Just... You know who was going to be Indiana Jones? Who it was offered to first? I think I some, I've heard it before, but I can't remember who. Tom was. Selleck. Interesting. Yeah, it was going to be Tom Selleck instead of Harrison Ford. Yeah, and when it, it, just like all these, if you put a different actor in it, oh, it's a lot of times. And there's some that are like, oh yeah, I could see that they'd probably do something a little similar, but it completely changes it. Of course, because the actors always bring if themselves. If Shah Rukh Khan role. is in Lagan, it's going to be completely different than Absolutely. Amir Khan in Lagan. It may still be good, but it's going to be completely different, and it, it's not necessarily going to work because it doesn't only what they said. It doesn't only uh, it, it embody the character with something new because that person is in it, but all the other parts that are played are going to be slightly changed because they're responding to what that person's bringing. Yeah. Yeah.
Yeah, really good video. Very fun to learn all this uh, old school stuff about uh, uh, the history Some of Some mind-blowing ones in there, uh, man. So if there's other videos we can react to, please let us know what those are down below. Just